how you can enable the TikTok tag and send tag events and API events on WordPress, on WooCommerce, uh, using Pixel Site Professional. I will show you the exact steps, how to get the tag ID, how to configure API events. It's very easy. You just need to generate a token. I will show you exactly from where, when to add it, where to add the token and everything that you need to know. So uh, this is Pixel Your Site, Pixel Your Site Professional. We don't have uh, TikTok support with our free version of the plugin. So once you have the paid plugin, you will see this section for TikTok and you need to add the TikTok tag ID in this field and the access token here. Uh, this one is for testing only the text code. I will record a different video explaining how to use it. But for now, let's get the TikTok tag ID if you don't have it already. So go to your TikTok ads manager, tools, events. Manage web events. Now, I already have a few tags um, here. I use them for testing. If you don't have any tag, you need to set up a new one. Click here, give it a name. Uh, now, select TikTok pixel, next. Manually install the code and select custom code. You don't need to uh, do the coding part yourself. Pixel Your Site does it for you, but this is what you need to select here because you want to generate the tag ID. Now, you don't have to copy anything. You can enable automatic advanced matching. It will improve matching and uh, click next. Now complete setup and copy this ID. So that's all you need in order to configure the tag. Now let's assume that you don't want to have API events yet. So save. And from this moment, Pixel Your Site will start to send events from your website. Let's configure API as well. And then I will explain what events uh, are fired and how you can uh, add other events if you need to. So uh, again, let's open. Now I need the access token. Go back to your events manager. I'm already on the um, tag page, but if I go back, you will see it something like here. So this is my new tag. Again, I will open it. Go to settings and uh, click here, generate access token. Copy the token, go back to Pixel Your Site, add the token and uh, save settings. Important, make sure that this is enabled. Enable TikTok conversion API. Enable and save. In this moment, Pixel Your Site will send tag events and API events. Each action will fire two events, tag event and an API event. Each event will share the same name and the same event ID. This is how TikTok will be able to deduplicate them so they don't record two events for the same action. It's similar to Meta, it's similar to Pinterest. Uh, so maybe you are already familiar with how this works. So uh, the tag event will be processed the API event will be the duplicated, so it will not be processed. If the tag event um, is not received for some reason, like, a, a, I don't know, an ad blocker, uh, TikTok will process the API event. So that's the whole point of API events. It, they are a sort of backup for um, the tag events. Now, when you have WooCommerce on your website, we send all the specific e-commerce events for TikTok and you can control them from here. So this is purchase. These are the events we send when an order is placed for uh, on your WooCommerce website. Check out, add to cart. 
So you can control all the e-commerce related events from here. If you have Easy Digital Downloads, which is a, another WordPress plugin for digital products, I don't have it installed here. Uh, you will see a dedicated page for Easy Digital Downloads with similar controls like uh, for WooCommerce. We also have our um, default events that, that are supposed to track key actions on your website. And from here, you can see those events. For example, we can track internal links and external links. And this is the event for TikTok. Now, TikTok has a particularity. Uh, they don't support custom events. So uh, we are rather limited with when it comes to uh, tracking all sorts of action on, on, on your website. We need to use um, standard events instead of custom events, like we can use for Meta. For example, uh, internal clicks and external clicks will be tracked by click button. So the same event, you can see it here, the same event. Uh, downloads, there is a TikTok event that tracks downloads called download and so on. For example, we don't have a page scroll because this is a custom event we send to our uh, to other tags, but we cannot send it to TikTok because they don't support custom events. And they also don't have any support for uh, custom parameters. So again, you cannot use a, a standard event and then some custom parameters to identify a particular action. So they're more limited, it's like a stripped out um, meta uh, version of, of, of the pixel and uh, the event set and parameters. So that's it. If you need to uh, configure your own event tracking some action from the events page here you can add events add new i have another video explaining how this works so set up the trigger various triggers and then configure the event for tiktok uh, if you configure the events using the tiktok events tool that they have in their ads manager those events will work on tag only they will not work on um, api so api if you want if you want api configure the events from here so that's it that's how um, events work and this is how you can enable tag and api events using pixel your site i will make another video showing you how to test your tag and api events uh, watch the other video as well. I will also explain a few uh, very common warnings that probably don't mean anything. So you will better understand how to test and understand uh, if the tag and if API events work as expected. Uh, thank you for watching. I'm Christian Stoichescu from Pixel Your Site. Like, share and subscribe to this channel.